reverberations from the shootings. They are shaking Asian Americans here in the tri-state. David Winter is at UC right now. He's been speaking with people who experienced hate just a short while ago and who are becoming even more concerned in light of the new violence against Asians. And first, though, we want to warn you that some of the content he's going to have in his story may not be appropriate for children. David? Yeah, thank you for that warning, Paula. Children shouldn't have to see or hear this, and neither should the students who go to school here. But this latest hate, it did happen here on campus during a Zoom call. And last night, what happened in Atlanta and around Atlanta, well, that just dredged up a whole lot of fear and despair. Mahati Venkatesh, Ashka Ravel, and Kim Nguyen are members of a group started at UC called United Asian Advocates. While having their first national Zoom conference, two men infiltrated the call. It obviously shocked everyone on the call, and it did not stop. We can take a second if that was a little bit triggering. I apologize. Shut the up, you Indian. Go back to India. There's a lot of people out there that um, want to exhibit violence in different forms, and we see that again um, with what happened last night. Um, just a, a mix of grief and anger towards what happens. There is a sense of insecurity that I feel walking down the road. Um, me and my roommate were both Asians. Um, so we were just talking about, you know, like, should we like put pepper sprays at the front door, like, you know, just to be safe. And we shouldn't feel that way on a college campus. Walking on the street is kind of scary for me, um, especially during these times when Asian hate crimes are rising. Should you have to feel this fear? I'm oh, sorry. I shouldn't have to, but unfortunately I do. We stopped by an Asian massage spa in Westchester where the owner says she's scared. I'm very concerned about our safety, uh, especially my uh, employees' safety. The president of Westchester Township's trustees summed it up. It needs to be reminded that we are all Americans, that we need to live in uh, peace and uh, equality and justice for all. And Mr. Wong says that he has now asked the chief of police of Westchester Township to step up patrols. We also spoke with the Chamber of Commerce for uh, the Midwest chapter of the Chinese Chamber of Commerce today. And they released an open letter asking for civility after all of this violence against Asian Americans. Paula? Hard to hear. Thank you. The United Asian Advocates, the student group that David just highlighted, delivered a letter today to the president of UC. It demands a denunciation of what happened to them, better access to reporting bias on campus, and requiring anti-racist training for incoming students.